Hello and welcome. This is Voice Meter, M E E T E R. Uh, I've still got a problem with echo. I don't know what to do about that. I'll probably figure that out later. And this is VST Host. And uh, <coughs> this is about noise reduction. How to, it's not real time, but it's close. Got a bit of latency though. And um, what we're doing, we are noise reduction. There we go. We're using VST host from www.hermanzibe.com. I'll be putting all these links in the description. Noise reduction, www.saviorofsoul.de. Voice meter, uh, VST plugins. It's all we found. So I think noise reduction one <coughs> installs itself in VST plugins. You have to, I would copy it somewhere else. Uh, and I copy it and rename it NR1, NR2, NR3, and then Floorfish DSA, quite good, from www.digitalfishphones.com. It's just a noise gate DSA thing. Um, so, once you've got all these set up, you need to set the default playback um, thingy from here as the virtual. Uh, recording no, playback devices. The default one needs to be set as voice meter input. That's M E E T E R once you've installed it. The default recording device is going to be your microphone. This one is a headset. And that's that. Um, you bring up VSD host and then you just drag in the VSDs you want to chain up, unchain them, and then just uh, right click and chain after and you go from the input which is the microphone to NR1 to NR2 to NR3 to full fish to out. Uh, this little thing here brings up the little um, VSD uh, console control panel attack maximum release minimum don't know about the others just gone with the standard noise reduction and then 512 FFT Capture noise profile, click on that, and then you'll need to be signed up for five to ten seconds and then click it to unclick it. And you do that for the first one, that sets up the initial noise reduction. Then you do a second one to get rid of any artifacts from the first one, same deal. Um, maximum attack, minimum release, 512. I think you can go down one more, but if you go to 64, it just well, for me, it just crashes. Then you click on catch the smaller the better on that. The, the more the louder the more um, noise. And so you have your you, you click on you you silent, you click on capture, wait five to ten seconds in silence, and then un untick it. And then finally floor fish. So if I do a bypass you'll see one, two, she sells seashells by the seashore. And then back again, seashell, seashore, shells by the seashore. <coughs> Just, so it's a nice de uh, uh, And that goes to an output, um, which is the, oh, because that, devices, wave, and its input is the microphone hardware, output is the DS. Vo voice meter, M E T E T E R, input, so virtual output, virtual input. Okay. But that takes us into um, voice meter. We've got two hardware inputs, we're not bothered about them. It's the virtual input, and then it goes out to the, the hardware out, which I've put down as the headphones. Uh, you want to start low and then build up. And if you get any feedback at all, you immediately close the programs. So here is the base and why it's cut set at maximum cut. Base, base, base. Medium, medium, medium. High. 
Hi, hi, hi. And those are those, and then you can right click, set your outputs, and I'll set it as the um, tactical range. So it should be all right. It's a little bit of latency because I've done a triple noise reduction pass, but hopefully it sounds clearer and better. You can always add extra ones like that. I've not found a decent natural voice vocoder, which I'm looking for, just to enhance people's voices without. I mean, they have auto tune, but I don't want to have to program in note changes. I just want something that adds a little bit of timber. Maybe I'll have to write something for that. Uh, so this is the VST host. I don't know if I've shown you the websites, so www.hermanzibe.com slash English slash VST host dot um, and that gives you the VST host which hosts the VSTs, digitalfish, <coughs> phones dot com gives you floorfish and also other ones if you want to play with them, stick them in and mess about, why not, can do, you might find something better. And then voice meter, M E E T E R. I just downloaded the Minecraft one. I think they're the same. It's very, very good. I'm surprised they're not charging money. But it's uh, donationware, so if you are making lots of money, why not give some money to people and improve the community? And if you make lots of money from something, why not give back to people? And this one is the noise reduction, which has a proper capture noise profile. That's the thing to look out for for a VST plugin for noise reduction. Can it capture noise and then just apply that um, sample? So it's very, very cool. Uh, and you just get the installer there. Seems to be a 64 bit one. Don't think it matters too much. You just drag it and drop it into VST host. You have your chain. It's very, very cool. Power of VST plugins. So, good luck with it all, and I hope this was useful. Any questions, put them in the comments. Try and be constructive, please. <coughs>